Quetzal Quattle Entertainment presents Quinn's Animation Extravaganza, episode 177, The Snowboard. Chapter 61 of Hemus Sentai Goranger. Well, since the snowboarding race on Naval Island is in two days, I think now would be a good time to design my snowboard. I'm looking for a design so special that I would at least be remembered in this race. Now I need to think of a way to make the board as durable and useful as possible. Alright, let's get started. Well, what's Quinton doing in there? He must be designing a snowboard for the race on Naval Island. I can remember when Quinton first unlocked his monster form last year. That was pretty amazing. He's been going stronger ever since. I bet he'll be able to win all four events in the Orange League. Considering how Quinton won the surfing competition on Mekon Island a while back, I think he's got this. Well, here's hoping he'll do well. Okay, so the board has to be of a very durable plastic so that I can withstand the blow from rock or boulder. Now the first thing I have to do is figure out how long I want the board to be. Let's see. Duh, how do you think he won the Coral Eye Badge from Matsumi? Oh man, I can hardly wait for the excitement! Well, Quinton is the ultimate power puff, so I expect him to do well. I think he might have a chance of winning all four events. Well, let's hope he does well in this event. Okay, I've decided about the length of my board. Now, what shape do I want the board to be? I need to make it able to support my weight in order to do a decent job in the race. I'm sure I'll come up with a decent shape eventually. I sure hope Quentin does well in the snowboarding race. Well, seeing as how he won the surfing competition on Mekon Island, I would bet that he would have an easy time in this event. I gotta say, I think Quentin likes us and our true forms more than we were ponies. It's a good thing we met him, or else there was no telling when the Black Ops fear a spell in the classroom would be broken. Does meeting him seem like so long ago? Definitely, but it was only a year ago. Well, let's hope Quentin wins the snowboarding race. Okay, I finished the board itself. It's three feet long and six inches wide, perfect for supporting my weight. Board is also made of a very durable plastic, perfect for withstanding any bow from rocks or boulders. And now comes the fun part. Let's paint this bad boy, shall we? Oh my god! Quentin's making a snowboard for the race on Naval Island! Well, he should be working on it by now, as the race is in two days. I can still remember when he saved me from the clutches of Bronze Mask. I can still remember when you introduced him to the rest of us. Well, let's see how a snowboarding race holds up! Alright, my snowboard is finally finished! I tried to paint it in a way that would make it so memorable that I would be cheered on by many of my friends. Since I'm against censoring animation, I decided to go with the board looking like a black sensor bar with a big red X around it. Well, I need to cool off, so I guess I could stop by Hooper's store for a soda. Come on! Hello, Quentin! How's the snowboard coming along? Oh, it's finished! Now we just need to prepare for the race itself! I'm sure you'll do well. Anyway, what will it be today? I'll have a Sprite Zero, please. Coming right up. You know, I'm now convinced that I might have a friendship with Mr. Hooper, don't you think? Okay, one bottle of Sprite Zero. Drink to your health. Thank you! Well, now that my snowboard has been finished, I just need to prepare for the race itself. I'm sure we'll be in the top five at least. Anyway, thanks for coming. Stop by whenever crime attacks again, okay? Alright, see you later. 
This episode was an original story created entirely for this show. Written by Quentin Cole, copyright 2019. This program is a production of Quetzalcoatl Entertainment. This is PBS, the public broadcasting service.